What is up guys, Matt the Rift Master here. So today, we're going to be talking about not being so stiff when you're playing that riff. That shirt smells like bubblegum. So guys, today I thought I would discuss a little topic that I've, uh, I've, I've noticed over the years of playing guitar and I, I've seen a lot of guitar covers online. And, um, and one guy I went to college with done this exact same thing. And like, I, I thought I would bring it to attention and discuss it because I mean, it's... It's just, it's just not good. So you may be wondering what, what me, what it means by "don't be so stiff" when playing that riff. Well, there's certain, certain riffs, not necessarily just like a riff, but even with lead parts, I've seen a lot of people when it comes to playing certain parts, it's just very stiff and there's no feel to it. There's no, it's just stiff. So I'll give you a quick example of what I mean of being stiff and, and how to, and then how you can play it to improve it to make it sound not so stiff. Okay, so starting off is one riff that I've, I, I've seen played very stiffly. Is that a word? Stiffly? Or in a stiff manner over the years and uh, it's... <laughs> so check it out. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Okay, that's pretty stiff, right? And I've, I've not, like, I'm not hating on it. So, you know, if that's, it's obviously not played that way. But I mean, if you're learning and progressing and that's all you've got right now, that's great. To get to that stage, that's awesome, okay? But now you want to just add a little more feel to it, a little more flow into the riff. Little bends, a little bit of vibrato on the strings. So to bring it to life, you want to make it sound something like this. You see how it sounds a lot better than just You know, I mean like I said if you've got that far and you're learning thumbs up to you You're doing good, but just give it a bit of life. Give it a few bends Yeah, bring it to life Simple. Okay, so like I said, it doesn't just apply for rhythm stuff. It's also the same for uh, lead stuff too. And here's a great example of when I was at college. Okay, a little story. I was playing at college and there was a guy who was in my band. Good guitar player. He was a cool guy. But oh my god. Okay, so we were playing Ace of Spades by Motorhead. And you know the little lead part that's in it? That part? Every time we would play it, we'd all be rehearsing, it would come to it. Everyone's in like a great mood because it's Motorhead. It'd come to it and all you would get was... And I would just like stand there and think, man, sounds shit. Like it all sounds great, but when it came to that part, it was just like... And it's just so boring and just stale and it doesn't, it just doesn't, it doesn't really work. Okay, so for things like that, the same thing you want to be doing is just add a little bit more flow into it, you know. A little bit of vibrato, a little bit more attack, a little bit more, you know, dynamics into it. Really smack them strings like a pony and make them ring and sing. Yeah, just so bent. Sliding in. Oh, make it sexy. Because Makes me want to be in a library, you know? So really, the moral of this video is, is exactly what it says in the title. Don't be a stiffy when playing that riffy. Or don't be so stiff when playing that riff. Like I did mention, if you're practicing, you're learning, and that's where you're at, you've done good to get that far, to be able to play that riff. So now your next step is to be able to develop that riff into something, riff or lick, into something that really just flows and works. So you don't want to be all jamming and it's coming up to your part, you know, your riff or your lick and, and you're just like a piece of cardboard, you know? It's just going to totally just, it's not going to work, it's not going to fit. So if you struggle with this, it's not a problem, okay? Just, just add a few more bends and a little bit more bit more life into it to bring it to life and really flow with the song 
and it'll just sound a lot better and it'll improve your playing along the way when you play more and learn more. So thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope some of you maybe, hopefully, take something away from it and try not to be so stiff when you're playing all your amazing riffs and lead parts. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up, comment below, share. Let me know if you have somebody in your life who's a bit of a stiffy. And we'll discuss it down below. So guys, thanks for watching. And as always, rock out, be awesome. And I will see you very soon. See ya!